here in downtown Toledo all about science, but they're also about serving the community and it does that through volunteers and there's a way that you can help out. Caitlin Sullivan is the volunteer coordinator and is here to introduce Alan coming up in just a minute from the Imagination Station. Caitlin, Imagination Station needs to operate with volunteers as well. Yes, it's a very important program. Tell, like, me, tell me a little bit about this and kind of how it works and how people like Alan have come into the picture to help you guys out. Sure, sure. We have a lot of uh, different opportunities kind of for um, every different interest that you can think of. So kind of all different people. Um, we have uh, opportunities for uh, not only people who love science, but people who uh, maybe like to work in a cafe hospitality setting, uh, maybe a little bit more hands on with our exhibit techs uh, working as an exhibit assistant. Uh, we also have a position for a visitor service so okay. you can help greet our, our guests. We'll get some more details on how we can do this coming up in a bit, but introduce us to Alan. This is Alan. He's one of our uh, floor team volunteers, and I think he's going to show you uh, some fun and exciting activities that he gets to do down at the Science Center. Alan, welcome in, and what are we going to start with here as far as an uh, science experiment activity? Well, we're going to make some green slime, and uh, it's it's a lot of fun. It's one of the crowd favorites in our uh, in our science studio, where I spend most of my time when I volunteer. Ellen, what's your background too? Might I ask too? How did you get involved with science and and, and want to volunteer at the Imagination Station? Well, I've been a chemical engineer for about 39 years. I retired a little while ago and uh, wanted to continue with that, so I looked up Caitlin. All right, it's a good way to kind of continue the fun and continue the learning for others. All right, so let's start with the slime. Okay, the slime, uh, really simple, is uh, made with uh, three different components. We have some uh, some clear glue, polyvinyl alcohol. Okay. We have some borax that you can buy in the grocery in the in the grocery store, a laundry booster, and just to make it interesting, we'll add a little bit of uh, green tempera paint to it. Okay. And uh, what we've got here, and uh, if you can help me out, sure, I'd be happy to. Is this the glue here? That's the glue. I'm going to add a little bit of the green here to our uh, to the borax solution that I prepared earlier. Okay. So Would you like up. me to dump this in, or does it need to be done simultaneously? Well. Um, I'll add it as you go. Okay. Okay, so anytime you're ready. I'm ready. And here we go. Just a little faster. All right. There we go. Okay. Well, you didn't hold back with the slime today, my friend. Yeah, we got plenty. Now the fun part comes in. That's why you got the gloves on. Okay. Let's go ahead and dip it in there and show everybody our, uh, our nice green slime. Ooh. You can see how it, uh, it kind of drips, but it's kind of a semi-solid. What we've done is a polymerization. We've uh, stuck the, the molecules of polyvinyl alcohol together with the borax and uh, essentially formed a polymer or a plastic. And uh, because it's loosely bound together, that's why it kind of drips and acts slimy. So this is the science behind Ghostbusters and Slimer himself, huh? That, that's right, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> Very cool. And a, uh, a good experiment that I think the kids would like to get hands-on. They do get to do hands-on. We do it at a little bit smaller scale in the museum, okay. but uh, they actually get to take little containers of it home with them. Very cool. Next up from us? Next up, we have Alka-Seltzer rockets, another favorite. All right. Caitlin, you're going to be an assistant on I this am. one, too. Yep. So Alka-Seltzer, again, you're going to be using different principles of science to kind of yep. show something how it propels, correct? That's correct. Alka-Seltzer is, is really two chemicals put together in a little tablet. Okay. It's uh, citric acid and uh, sodium bicarbonate. When those two chemicals mix in the water, they, uh, they give off carbon dioxide. We're going to snap the lid on top of here. Okay. I'll just show you here in a, set, sure. for a second. The bottom side of the lid is the side that goes down. Yep. Everybody confuses that. Okay. And uh, when we put it on, make sure you get it to it so it snaps. Right. Okay. So uh, very simply, um, Caitlin's going to do this at the same time. We're all going to have, have one. I'm going to give you a little launcher here to put oh, yours into. All right. It's a little more fun. Make it fun. So okay. just drop your, your uh, tablet in. Put the okay. lid on as quickly as you can. Make sure it snaps. Lid down. Okay, and in about and, 10 or 15 seconds. Yeah, you seconds. have to give it a little bit of patience. Yep. And Caitlin, while we're waiting this for to, to go, how can we get more involved with the Imagination Station? How do people like Alan get in touch with you guys? Oop, there there goes go. one. There goes two. <laughs> Got oh, one third more. Third one waiting. And one more, one more waiting in the shoe. There we there it go. Goes. <laughs> Very uh, cool. Well, the first step to get involved would be to kind of decide what you might want to do as a volunteer. So visiting our website would be a good place to start. We have okay. all of our positions listed there. Um, and the next step would be to fill out an application. So okay. uh, that application will come straight to me, and I can call you and answer any questions that you might have. Who benefits from this? The kids, right? The kids, exactly. All right. Like this. We'll see if we can get one or two more fired off really quick.
Alan, how long have you been doing this for with the Imagination Station? I've been with Imagination Station about five months now. Okay. And I'm sure you love every minute of it. It's a good chance to <laughs> teach more science. That's All right. right. Well, we appreciate you guys coming in. I think that one's going to go any second. There we go. There we go. <laughs> there we go. Knew we were going to have it. All right, Caitlin, thank you so much. Alan, you as well. Thank you so much for coming in. More WTL than New York Day coming up in just a moment. Stay with us.